welcome back to Visions. I'm Mirella Rich. If you've just joined us, we're here with Ralph Knight, who runs programs on Community Radio 3CR, and he's talking to us about a few hot topics. <laughs> welcome back to the program. Thank you. And um, what are your thoughts on politics and theocracy? Well, uh, the Australia, uh, within the Australian context, I feel that uh, the current government and um, I dread to say it, the opposition seem to be losing touch with real people and real world, um, the real world, that's local issues that people are facing. Uh, some, uh, some of it is uh, the intrusion of um, the theocracy, if you like, where you have highly religious people in government trying to put their religious views into law, which um, I think very often finishes up with disastrous consequences. The abortion laws are perhaps um, one, one that stands out. Uh, people should be uh, free to make the moral decision as to whether or not they they go through with that abortion or not they shouldn't be forced because if people um, are forced only to make the moral decision it means that they haven't really made a moral decision they're just following a law which may badly affect them it's the same with um, with the american idea of prohibition that started in 1919. Uh, I think most people would uh, agree that uh, drinking excessive alcohol is a bad thing. Mm. But to force people not to drink it means that the individual no longer has the freedom to decide whether or not they will drink. And mm. It's very important that uh, individuals have the freedom to make their moral decisions as to what they do. That's interesting, isn't it? Because some people would rather, like say if they were alcoholics, mm. they would rather alcohol was not available because the temptation is so strong. That, what would you say that's in right. that situation? That, that, is, um, that is a sickness. Um, people, some people do have a predisposition to uh, become an alcoholic. That is a danger, but once again the consequences of it being legislated means that they are coming into the criminal justice system rather than um, seeking the medical model. The same, the same with drugs. A lot of people have problems with drugs and mm. my personal opinion is that they're silly if they start. Mm. But having said that, what makes a problem worse is the legal cure or, or the legal remedies that are available, the criminality. Mm. We should all go stigma. back to nature. Mm. I think we should all go back to fresh fruit and vegetables, nuts yes, and seeds, absolutely. sunshine and fresh air, mm. mountains and rivers. Yes. If we, were, if we all lived like that, we'd be all totally healthy, mm. full of energy. Yeah, and in peace. But, but this is uh, yeah, the ideas that I've been putting across come close to anarchism, um, which is something I, I don't think will ever work. But it's one of these lovely thoughts, <laughs> where you have a, a, a well-behaved society without any laws because the members of the society. This, this is probably um, the the pretty picture of anarchism, not rock throwing and uh, violence. But where uh, there's no need to have laws because people don't, um, if you had the laws, it wouldn't make any difference because people have chosen not to transgress those To be yeah, responsible for themselves and yes. live a good life themselves, mm. yeah. That, that, is, um, that, that is basically the idea of the old-fashioned anarchism, not, um, not being... Not people not going and throwing rocks and rioting, that sort of thing, mm. which you hear in the public media, oh, it's total anarchism, mm, okay, yes. which uh, is the exact opposite to what um, most anarchists who 
claim to be anarchists are about. That would be interesting, yeah. wouldn't it? There's an example of this in Germany mm. uh, where there were two men met each other on the internet and one was a cannibal and the other one agreed to be eaten. Oh, lovely. Which uh, you well, might it would have... be dessert or main meal? Uh, I, I don't know, probably <laughs> the main meal. But, but this actually happened. Yeah. And... <sighs> It turned out that the trial collapsed because Germ uh, Germany had not uh, really passed any laws concerning cannibalism, so it caused great legal problems. And the, the idea of anarchism is that, um, you, you know, the fact that uh, it's obviously wrong for somebody to eat another person. Absolutely. Uh, but <laughs> no the there. reason that there'd been no laws is that it was never a problem until this happened. So what happened? Did it happen? Oh, it did happen. He got yeah. eaten? Yeah. And How long ago was this? Well, about, uh, probably about ten, within the last ten years. Yeah. It, and, um, and it happened because there was no law against it? No, it, it, no it. he was just a nut, if you like. <laughs> But really? <laughs> uh, the, the consequences that fo followed, the, there was a great deal of, of difficulty with the law charging him with murder because it wasn't quite murder. And uh, I'm, not a, I'm not a legal person, but there were a number of legal difficulties. And um, the, the reason that I'm, I'm citing that as, as an example of anarchism was that there's no law that specifically forbade... Uh, cannibalism because nobody had thought anyone was Ever gonna stupid do it. enough to do it. Yeah. That, that, that's, that's just an example. So what happened to the eater, the one that ate him? I'm not sure. I think he finished up in jail. I think they found something to charge him with, but it oh. was, um, it was a, a, great, um, a great deal of, um, of um, controversy. Absolutely. But the, the point I'm getting at is that if, if you have a society that uh, doesn't particularly transgress um, each other's well-being, mm. there's no need to have, have a lot of the laws that uh, are existing. Yeah. It's a different sort of society yeah. and it's simply a political ideal which um, I don't think... Um, it's possible. Pes pessimistically, I don't think it would work, but it'd be nice if it did. Yeah. Mm. All right, we're about to go okay. to a break now. You're watching Visions. Stay with us. We'll be back with more very shortly.